Hello, you beautiful, beautiful people. Welcome to some delightful, wonderful Star Citizen. How's it going? I'm just in bed here. I love it. I've started loading into Star Citizen. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Wait, is, is that actually... Is the door open or is that... Okay, okay. Good to know. I was... <laughs> It's like, oh my goodness, there's a hole in my ship. But no, it was just a graphical glitch. Uh, I've started, like, uh, playing this game with... And by... Rather than signing out and starting in, a, in like, a space station, I get into beds and I wake up. And the vibe you get waking up in the game and looking out at situations like this are so cool. I love it. Anyway... If you enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe. We've got some awesome videos on the way. But my last video was pretty chill. It was pretty relaxing. Uh, it was showing off this little amazing... Whoa! Hold up, hold up. Amazing little terrapin here, uh, which I kind of love and adore. Hang on. have to... Uh... Oh, there we go. Kind of got my mouse configured a little bit weird. Look at that screenshot, by the way. I'm print screening that. Holy. Um, I showed off this little terrapin. And it looks so cute. It's awesome. But if you don't know, it's kind of useless in a combat uh, situation. So I'm just going to get away from the base here. Um, but it's got what's called, I can't remember, distortion lasers? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. what happened there? I started turning to the right for some reason. Uh, what? Oh, oh, I know. Hang on, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> Should be fine now? Yeah, sh cool, cool, cool. Um, yeah, no, this aircraft, the Terrapin, Star Citizen's most tankiest turtle, uh, only comes with distortion things, which is good in, like, a squad situation, because they're really good at disabling shields, but you're not going to kill anyone with distortion lasers. So I want to see if I kit out this little beauty with some actual damage dealing turrets. If we can do a couple of uh, bounty missions. I just think that would be really awesome. So uh, yeah, if you enjoy this video, drop a like. And in the prediction comment section, I'm calling it today. And let me know whether or not you think we're going to be able to turn this little beast into a, uh, a damage dealing machine. Hope so, because it's really cool, and I'm I'm actually kind of fond of the Terrapin. It's kind of a nice workman's vehicle, you know. With that all in mind, <laughs> we need to get a couple of things. The first thing we need to go to Lawville, which is a place I've never been before, so that'll be good fun. And the other thing I need to go to afterwards is go to her L5 to then pick up the Atlas, which is really useful to increase the quantum drive in this thing. Because FYI, it's slow. Now, you're not going to see any of that, but um, yeah. <laughs> like I say, it's really freaking slow, so I do want to upgrade this ship if I can. So, um, anyway, I'll see you when we get to Hurston for the first time. It's going to be a cute first experience for me, but like I say, you guys have probably seen it a million times. Okay, guys, I know this is, uh, we're not there yet, but something just blew my mind. Look at this. So I've got a throttle in real life, and there's a throttle right in front of me, and look. Oh, animation. It's a bit of a weird animation. It doesn't really work. <laughs> kind of my hand fades through the throttle, but, you know, I kind of appreciate the fact that it's translated. That's pretty neat. Can't do the joystick right now, although it looks, it actually is identical to the one there. So maybe, <laughs> in fact, that is my joystick. That's amazing. It's almost like the Terrapin was made for me. Well, little man, we're going to make you, uh, we're going to make a little monster out of you. Yeah, you see. Whoa, what's this? Quantum. Uh, what? What? Who are these chumps? Uh, get out of that. Okay, well, I don't have the firepower, so I'm just gonna hopefully get out of this. <laughs> oh no! Hopefully they'll let me get out. Hey, suckers! Suck on my turtle butt! My first experience, ladies and gentlemen, of Lawville. While we were also traveling, by the way, to uh, Lawville here, uh, I also decided to get some other parts. So I've also got another shopping list. 
of power cooler and um, power cooler and shield, sorry. And they're all at crew L1. So that's super easy. So I, luckily they're all at the same place. So we've only got a little bit of shopping to do. But this is cool. Lawville. Let's check out Lawville. Now apparently Lawville is a huge industrial city. Uh, that has completely just been absolutely rinsing the land. Oh, this place looks fun. Let's check this out. Whoa. Let's go into first person view. Not first person, this is third person. Good job, Ollie. Wow. Oh, that is a monumental tower. Yeah, it definitely has some kind of like rusty vibes, you know, industrial rust vibes. Oh, there's a player over there. That's so cool. Uh, yeah, I'm assuming the parking is somewhere in the middle. But I don't, like, I genuinely have no idea. Look at the size of that tower. Man, i got to get me some, like, law books or something to just read up on this stuff. Because it's super interesting. Okay. Oh, hang on. There's, like, writing everywhere. Um, Hello. Spaceport. Thank you for contacting EDO Landings. Well, I didn't, but, um... <laughs> this is awesome. It's kind of like Art Corp Area 18. Fairly similar in terms of color palette, I suppose. All right, so we've got a little pod thing. Right, let's uh, <laughs> go into third person here. Nice. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That's a tight squeeze. Hang on. Landing gear. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful. A little bit close to the edge there, but we made it. We made it. I'm kind of curious, actually, guys. What's your favorite, now that I've visited every, uh, so far in the game, at least until Pyro comes out, every location? Um, what's your favorite city to, to visit or spend most of your time? Um, Lawville looks pretty nice. Everything's kind of yellow and... Wow, look at... Whoa, this place is cool. Oh, there's actual stuff here. Nice. I like this place. Okay, let's store the Terrapin here. Nice. And what we want to do is find ourselves... Oh, I've got to look out the window. Oh, constellation there. That's awesome. Ha! Huh, love that. Uh, it's like an actual airport. <laughs> it's so cool. I love the fact I'm still discovering stuff. 22 videos. in Like, after making 22 videos, I'm still kind of discovering stuff. It's great. I can love it. Um, so I'm assuming here we're going to find, if I just follow this... Uh, place? What, didn't this look normal? Yeah. Um, we're looking for... Let's have a quick look. I'm looking at my second screen. Uh, HQ Showcase. Okay. Uh, business District or Spaceport to Metro Center. Um, I'm going to say Central... Uh, like Business District, I guess? Okay, I double-checked, and I am heading in the right place. Also, it's Hurston Dynamic Showcase. I said, hey, I think I said HQ before, because the uh, font on my second monitor is pretty small. But it's HD Showcase, which obviously, blah, means Hurston Dynamics. So, yeah, now we know. But at least we're getting on the right train. We're not having a repeat of our last video. We've run across into this train. No! Oh, you son of a... Oh! <laughs> God damn it! Oh. And I love the fact if people were flying in or flying out, you'd actually see them in the game. That's awesome. Oh, I can... No, never mind. I was going to say, I can kind of see where we're going, but not really. It does say not to lean on the door, so... I'm going to follow the rules. Wait, is this how long it's going to take me? 45 seconds? Nice. Oh, there's a player. 
Hey, dude. What's up? Whoa! Okay. This is a bit of me. I'd love a gold statue of myself. Look at that! Ho ho ho! This place is... You know, I'm coming around on good old Hurston. He knew what he was doing. Solid gold. Love it. Mmm. See, if you're a business guy, you get nice, uh, you get gold stuff. You get the shiny stuff. This is what we want. Even the stairs are gold. Ooh. Class. Ooh. All right, what we got? Undersuit. Undersuit. Ah. Sometimes people just leave good stuff, and it's kind of awesome. But this is all stuff I don't want. What's the... Oh. Oh, wait. Scatter gun. We don't want the scatter gun. We want... Uh, I mean, we could just use a computer, but man, look at the size of that. <laughs> now that is a big boy. That's gonna that's gonna make a dent. It's so shiny though. Right, is there a computer somewhere I can use? Showcase. Here we go. This is what I'm looking for. Hello, sir. <laughs> it is actually blowing my mind. This game. Uh, as I say that, there's literally a headless guy, like, just kind of stood around. But it's actually blowing my mind how... Oh, so many weapons! Like, I've not seen this stuff, and I've been playing for, like, three weeks now. So cool. I want the big gun. Can I, can I just strap that onto the top of it? Now that would work. What do you think? No, he's looking away from me. He's judging me. Right, okay. Trading console. This isn't what I... Uh, Guns. I love how it's just a category called guns. So we're looking for. Or maybe I'll. Maybe I had a scar gun selected. Okay, so I'm gonna go with this instead. Uh, the repeater here. I think that is gonna be a good idea. Maybe. It does 400 damage. So. I mean, it's better than nothing. So we're, <laughs> it's better than what we got. So I need two of those. And we'll stick that on my ship. Uh, that's pretty cool. But yeah, this is more of a scatter gun, so it's kind of like a shotgun. Which actually wouldn't be such a terrible idea. But um, it's kind of just not what we're looking for. Holy... What? Oh, i got to find a ship that I can stick that on, because that would make a fantastic video. Holy... Okay, so loadout time. Let's put this on. Turret placeholder. So there, there might be a turret like opportunity at some point, but there we go. So I'm gonna equip that one on there, equip that one on there. So now we've got some actual, hopefully, damage, uh, which will be good. We can actually see them on there as well. So save changes, and yeah. Now I guess we are gonna head to her L5 to put on the Atlas, which is a better quantum drive, and then a quick little trip to crew L1. And then, my friends, we're going to see if the little Terrapin can become the ultimate warrior ship. How do I get out of this place? This is highly confusing. Transit. It's kind of weird, though, this place. Because it's all, um, you know, so nice and gold and super, like, ooh, shiny in this area. But the rest of Hurston is like... I mean, it's not the greatest place to visit. It seems kind of dusty and lame. No, I just missed the train. All right, here we go. All right, before we take off, I do want to look at these new weapons we've put on. Ooh. Nice. Cool. Hopefully, they'll do at least some damage. <laughs> That's all I'm hoping for. As long as we can do any damage, I'll be happy. So, uh, yeah. Next stop is her L5. So I'll see you guys when we get there. Hey guys, uh, so here we are at her L5, little space station. Uh, yeah, good place to pick up the Atlas, which is a really nice uh, quantum drive. Um, that will hopefully mean I have good distance. I mean, the distance is fine, but it will just boost my speed. Because at the moment, the quantum takes a long time, which isn't ideal. So, um... Yeah, we're just working on that, and hopefully this should make our lives a little bit quicker. Or should just enable us to do more in a day, I should say. I love how polite these space stations are. Have a pleasant stay. I will, thank you. 
All right, Platinum Bay. How's it going, buddy? Uh, yeah. So, what we want, if it will work. Uh, hello? Work, please. So annoying. Oh, let's try this one. Hang on. That's another machine. Ha <laughs> ha! You can't fool me. Okay, so Quantum Drive Atlas. Here we go. This is the one we want. So let's put that in. Thank you. Lovely. Quantum Drive. So, yes, we're going to buy it. Going to use the Atlas here. Lovely. Crew L1. My favorite space station because I like to do mining runs here. And it's great. And I love it. And it's awesome. A little Cutlass Black, someone taking off in there. That's awesome. Love that. Landing gear. All right, Platinum Bay. And I'm going to use this machine because the other one doesn't work, maybe. Not sure. All right, system. So the first thing I'm going to buy is a power plant. I'm not... Honestly, I probably don't need this stuff. But I'm going to get it anyway. Because, I mean, it's all about making the coolest, most badass... Um, turtle, right? So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so yeah, we want. How do we? How many of those do we want? We want two of these. Freezing, twenty-four-seven. It's gonna be great. And I need three of these. So, one, two, three. All right. So power plant. We've got this one. So size two, grade B. So it's a slightly different one here. Yeah, I don't know if this is any, actually any better, but I, I'm pretty sure it is. And then the coolers, we've got uh, three of these, the Thermax. And there we go. And then the shield generator, we're using the FR-76. I think these are all upgrades. <laughs> so we should be good. Obviously, we've got the weapons on here as well. So nose. So I wonder if we could put a different mount on and just use a big cannon guys in the comment section let me know is it possible to put a different like mount on and do that because if it is i'm definitely doing that in my next video right just 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 basically a walking turret is what i want oh the guy's gone for lunch i see so let's go let's do this here it is <laughs> the ultimate terrapin loadout potentially mark one i'm gonna call it or mark two this is the Mark II, right? So uh, that's exciting. Let's close that door. And let's... I, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you can look and see the new parts. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks... Well, I love the fact that you can actually see the upgrades, like, physically. That's such a cool thing. Unfortunately, there's some locked doors here. And I, for the life of me, can't work out how to unlock them. Um, maybe I have to press... Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I've tried the in the uh, seat here pressing unlock, but that doesn't seem to do it. So I'm not sure. Rather strange. Not that it matters. I'm like it's it's cool. We get the point. It's just a absolutely tank of a ship that we should all fear now. All right, Vito. Uh, we probably need to. I had to do this before. Landing gear. Vito! Oh, ho, ho. now we're cooking. Now we're ready to go. Such a cool ship, isn't it? Just got such an awesome vibe to it. Right, okay. So, my plan here, ladies and gentlemen, is to go to back to Microtech. So, I'll see you when we get there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, what the heck? Looks like we've been uh, pulled in here. But you know what? I'm not going to allow this. I ha I'm going to have to deal with it. Whoa. Oh, no. My targeting computer's done in. Oh, no. There we go. There we go. We're good. We're good. Let's see if we can do this. Let's test out this thing. Whoa, that was close. Come here, bro. You're going down. Oh, is he, are you starting to joust me, bro? I, I, yeah, okay. 
Literally, okay. He's literally trying to ram me. You nutcase. <laughs> that was very, very, very close there. Come on. Oh, that was some good hits. He's got no shields, so we are getting through to him. Oh, shit. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes, exactly. And can you stop doing that, bro? It's so annoying. Every time. <laughs> I'm not as maneuverable. I'm a giant turtle. Oh, my goodness. The only way to fix this is to literally uh, just get some distance and then turn around. Come on. <laughs> nice. Good stuff. Alright, well, you're welcome, Laszlo. Alright, with that done, let's do our bounty mission here that we came here to do. Uh, which is over here. Nice. Just got to clear my map here. Let's clear route. There we go. Nice. Let's see how we get on. You have got to be kidding me. Really? All right, sure. Huh. All right, well. What in the world? I hate auto mode. I'd rather do the work myself, you know? I have been <laughs> pulled out of quantum far too many times today. Oh, wow. You don't be very funny. Here we go. You are going to die, sir, with my super powerful turtle. Really? Oh my goodness. That's what you get, sir. <laughs> All right, on to, like, wow. I should get. I guess I'll carry on. Who is this person? I have no idea. I guess that is some random. Alright guys, once we've done this, let me know in the comment section whether or not you want me to see if uh, I can go up against much trickier uh, targets here. Because these ones are pretty easy, you know, providing you've got a ship and you can kind of do your thing. So, yeah, I'll be kind of interested to see if you guys want to see this go up against anything a little bit more tough. Uh, if I have done that, I'll put a connotation at the end of the video, but yeah. If you want me to see that, if you want to do that and you want to see that, do let me know. Alright, so we have been targeted here. It's probably going to be two ships, I imagine. That's fine. Don't mind that at all. This thing is super tanky, so <laughs> we can take some shots. It's not a problem. Uh, there we go. Decoy the missiles. Woohoo! That's awesome. Love that. Okay. Hey, we found our target. Let's go. Okay. See if we can get him here. Nice. Wow. <laughs> Whoa, I love this thing. That was huge. We literally just did that in one, like, run. Or joust, if you like. I want to do that again. This thing is super powerful. Certainly did the job there. Get a little bit closer. Wait until the marker turns green. And he's going to feel a world of pain. There we go. Start firing. Oh. 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 Just missed that. Whoa. Okay. So we got his shields. Um... Wait, is there... A, there must be a third guy. Okay. He's firing missiles at me. Someone is shooting me who is above me somewhere. Oh, I, 
can't I can't get an angle on him. Where is he? Uh, put shields on. Let's get some distance. Restricted area. Oh, okay. It was just the mining facility. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that was freaking me out then. I was like, I can't see where the firing's coming from. But yeah, no, it was because it was coming from the ground. All right, guys. So I'm going up for a slightly more challenging target here. Probably going to have a few more goonies and whatnot. I'm trying to level up so I can do the more challenging things. But um, yeah, it's a little bit of a trek. But I'm not annoyed at all. Because have you seen how amazing this place is and how good it looks? Wow. <laughs> Man, this game is so freaking awesome. I can't get over how good this has looked uh, the whole time. It's just been such a nice chill vibe. Anyway, enough of the chill vibes. It's time to eliminate Jabba. Not the heart, just Jabba. Whoever this wannabe Jabba is. So uh, we are descending pretty quick. Right, I'm going to reduce my speed now. Okay, a little missile, that's good, got rid of that, ooh, blue one, fancy. Okay, so, looks like we've got a few targets here, we're going to deal with this guy first, I think. Uh, wow, we're getting straight into it, huh? Woo! Okay, so that's a 350, I think. Very, I think that's a similar ship to the one we uh, were fighting earlier. Whoa! Yeah, he likes to joust, doesn't he? Holy! There he is. I see you, boy. Let's get him in my sights. Nice hits there. Shields. Okay, hitting the shields. Getting some good hits on. Nice. Oh my goodness me, this is a child's play. Alright, who's next? Where's my victim? This isn't... Like, both of these guys aren't actually people we're targeting here. Okay, so we've got another guy here. Whoop. Hey, dude. What's up? He's his little goonies, if you will. Wow, he's like jousting me. They're doing what they should do, which is like using the fact that I am a big tanky boy <laughs> to their advantage here. They're really getting away with just being a pain and avoiding me. Not actually doing any damage to me, which is nice. But they're making hitting them a real challenge. Oh, that's a nice... Oh, okay, so I've got the shields. Here we go. Nice. Right, Jabba, you're next. <laughs> oh, this is good. I like these upgrades. This little ship here carries its weight. It does the job, you know? Does the job. This is a great place to visit, by the way. <laughs> Looking good. Like, what's the down there? It's like little islands. So, okay, there he is. Nice. Is he just, la like... Is he flying or is he parked? Looks like he's not moving. It's only a little bomber, stealth bomber thing. Whatever it's called. Eclipse. Is he just on the water? I don't know. Looks like some serious desync. Doesn't look like he's moving, you know. Is he moving? Yes, he's moving. Okay. Whoa! Okay, that's worrying. Okay, I'm going to have to end him before he... Uh, This is weird. Bro. Why are you so rude? Alright, you know what? <laughs> this is the weirdest fight I've ever seen. Very strange. Why is he so... I should not get this close when the server's being weird, but... I think he's just going to explode now. In three, two, one. Really? How are you not dead yet? Can you not do that? It's good to... 
It's good to know that the shields are actually holding up super well. Like, he was firing at me for quite a while there. <laughs> Wasn't really doing much damage. Okay, all right, let's put an end to this. Oh! Oh, he hit me! You blew in... It's a new lick of paint, bro! Okay. He's just gonna try and ram me now, isn't he? Because you're a coward! Satisfying explosion. <laughs> yeah, it looks like... Um, that was only a low-risk target, but... Doesn't look like any cosmetic damage here. But look at these mountains! You know what? Let's go and land on one. Alright guys, well, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, drop a like, and uh, I will see you in the next video. That's on screen now, which you should definitely go and watch because it's probably awesome. See you later. Bye-bye.